Hello, Scorpios. This is your zodiac sign message. So right away we have here energy who feels like they're not able to make a decision. They feel like that they're stuck in some type of delay or they're having some type of dispute or they're really frustrated with the delay of something and it's causing them to be at a stalemate. Like they're they're not able to to fully trust their decision. With flower, and I'm just gonna show these really quick. It's the eight of wands reverse, and then the two of swords. Now with flowers, be honest with yourself, which is funny because it came out in a previous read. I believe it was Virgo or Libra, I'm not sure, but in this one, it's coming right out. So it's a direct in your face message. It's not a underlying energy. It's it's saying directly that there's something that you're holding back. There's something just below the surface that you know to be true or a situation that you may see for what it is and you're not speaking a, a truth or you're not living in some form or fashion in your authenticity. And you may feel bad or you may, I won't say bad, I'll say you might feel like Whatever this blockage or delay or frustration or dispute is that has you in a space of indecision, you feel like it could cause maybe damage, that this could potentially hurt someone or damage a potential environment. Um, somehow this truth is going, could, can move mountains, so to speak. It's a very big truth. Or maybe you feel like your truths, your your living in your authenticity isn't regarding confidence. I'll say you don't have the confidence to speak your truth or live in your authenticity somehow, and it's causing delays in your life or causing delays in your current path. And spirit is urging you to be honest with yourself. For the most part, these delays are related to trust, honesty, and compatibility, uh, most likely with others or being honest or having trust in yourself. And what Spirit is trying to relay is that you speaking your truth and living in your authenticity is what's going to shift this card right around. It's going to give you full movement and speed. It's going to pick things up with excessive force so and remove this blindfold from you so the other energy that I'm getting from this is that you could be in very deep contemplation about something you could be taking some time out to deliberate what is the best next step for your path with this card here uncertainty this is uh, uh, it's sort of a version of the tower card um, some type of sudden insight um, some new insight a sudden upheaval or change has taken place or will soon uh, be taking place in your life and that may also play a part in what this very deep indecision and deliberation is that's causing this delay and frustration in your current path this could all very well also have something to do with a commitment, something that you possibly feel binded to, a contract. Now, with regards to that, it says here, I'm, I'm getting the feeling that a lot of the answers you already have, I think it's just a matter of just coming down to a final, okay, yes, this is the truth. This is what I'm going to finally, you know, accept and live in. I think it's acceptance that you're having a hard time grappling with. And I think once you fully embrace that living in your authenticity, I'm sorry, your authenticity, speaking your truth and being honest with yourself, all of this will finally unravel for you and you'll feel a sense of relief that you didn't you didn't think would originally be possible. So that is my message for you, 
Spirit would like for you to be honest with yourself. It, it's hard to see right now. You may think that it's going to damage things, possibly a, a contract or something that you feel binded to. But I think you've deeply contemplated long enough that you know what the answer is to your your question or to your desire or to to what that great that great query is that you have. It's just a matter of speaking it, putting it out into the world and letting it be known because your truth is valid. You really can move mountains and you just need to see that for yourself. Blessed be.